Okay, today in math, we are going to learn how to break apart a number to help add two digit numbers. Recently, we've been talking about how we can take a 10, a 10 stick, and break it apart into ones, like five ones, and five ones, to help us add. We're going to do the same thing today, only with two digit numbers, like 23 plus 9. We're going to break apart our 9 to make 23 the next 10. Can anyone tell me what the next 10 would be? Yes, 30. So, how many more do I need to get to 30? 7. So we're going to break apart our 9 into a 7. And what plus 7 will give us 9? 2. So in our brains, we can use that 7 plus 23 is 30. And all we have to do now is add 2 more, which gives us 32. That's what we're going to be learning today. All right, we're going to get out our base 10 blocks and we're going to model a couple numbers and think about how we would break it apart. All right, let's model the number 32. How many 10 sticks do I need to model the number 32? Yes, three. So I'm going to lay out three 10 sticks. 10, 20, 30. How many ones? Do we need to lay out to make 32? Just two. Very good. So what's the value of my tens? 30. And what's the value of my ones? Two. How many more ones do I need to get a new ten stick? What plus two gives us ten? Eight. So I would need eight more, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Once I have eight more, I can trade out my ones for another ten stick. Okay, now I'm going to give you a problem, and I want you to model the numbers that I give you. So on your math board, I want you to draw a line down the middle of your paper. This is for the first number. This is for the second number. Griffin had 27 books about animals and six books about space. How many books did he have in all? So what was my first number? 27. What was my second number? Six. Okay. I want you to model out the number 27 using your base 10 blocks and model out the number six using your base 10 blocks.
Okay, on your paper it should look like this. You should have 2 ten, 6, that's worth 20. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 ones to make the number 27. On this side you should have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 ones. Now let's look at this right here. How many more ones cubes do I need to trade out for another 10? Yeah, I only need one, two, three more. So what we're going to do is we are going to borrow three from our six and move them over into this column. So I'm going to take these three, one, two, three, and move them over to 27. Now I no longer have 27. How many do I have? Ten. 20, and this is another 10 sticks, so it would be 30. We can trade out our ones for a 10 stick. And now we have 30 on this side. And how many do I have left over here now in, my, in this column? Yes, just three. So now we can do the easy math problem in our head. 30 plus 3 equals 33. Today at Math Centers, you're going to choose the app Math Facts and choose the game Number Bonds. Drag the game down to this dot. Okay, it says, in this game, you have to find all the addition facts that add up to the same number. What number? Choose a number from the tiles below and drag it onto the question to start. So, I'm going to show you 10 because that's going to have the most facts to add up. Alright, so it's telling me that there are 9 facts that I have to find that add up to 10. So the first one that I know is zero. Zero plus what will give me ten? Ten. So I'll drag those two numbers and it'll tell me if it's right. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and go with the one next. One plus nine also gives me ten. Hmm, I'm going to try six. Okay, what plus six will give me 10. 4. 2. 2 plus 8 also gives me 10. 3. 3 plus 7 gives me 10. And 5 plus 5 gives me 10. Okay, so this is an app to help us with those number bonds and making tens. Since we're learning how to add two-digit numbers, we need to know how to get to the next ten. So this is just more practice. So we're going to say that we want to play again, because you're only playing the number bonds game. I'm going to try, I'm going to try five this time. Okay, let's look up here. There's only three problems that I can use to get to five. And it's telling me that I cannot use 6, 7, 8, 9, or 10, because those are above 5. Okay, so I'm going to start with 5. 5 plus 0 is 5. What's 1 plus what gives you 5? 4. Okay. 3 plus 2 also gives you 5. And tell me I did a good job again. Remember, when you get to this screen, you do not go to play another game. You always go to play again.